So this is what happens when you don't know how to reframe in Filmora 12. Welcome to Filmora where we create amazing video and a beautiful world of imagination. My name is Prakar and I am Filmora Certified Creative who create amazing content and Filmora tutorials. I have my own YouTube channel which is named by Katukat Reviews and you can follow my channel in the description link below. So in this video, I'm going to talk about how to auto reframe your video and create amazing video with the help of Filmora 12. Now the biggest advantage of auto reframing is not only it saves your time, but also it stops you from recreating videos in various formats. I'll show you how it is done. Let's get inside the computer. So auto reframe feature can be done by several ways. The first and the most easiest way is from the main menu. Once you open the Filmora, you have this main screen and here you can find auto reframe feature you just click on it and your video will be auto reframed but there's another way which you can find inside the filmora you go and you upload the video here whatever video you have to auto reframe just upload that video from here you can right click on the video and from here you go from the drop down menu here you can see the auto reframe so there are two very easy ways from which you can auto reframe the video but let's do the easiest way which is from here just put the auto reframe and then here you can import your video so once you're done importing your video from here you can select the aspect ratio so make sure you select one is to one for all the social media sites like instagram tiktok so make sure the aspect ratio is one is to one and after that motion speed you just put auto and then you analyze so the ai will analyze your video real quick and then it will spot you and it will be working around your face so see as you can see it is adjusting itself and you are on the frame and then once you are done you can export it so now let me tell you what will happen when you don't do the auto reframing so this video is 16 by 9 and if i don't auto reframe it and i'll try to do it by myself so as you can see in the video how this is cutting me from the frame so this is what happens when you don't do the auto reframing so the biggest disadvantage of not doing the auto reframe is that you will be cut off from the video and you have to do everything manually so also when you compare the left hand side which is auto reframe video and the right hand side which is not you can see that the one which is not is having the black frame on the corner and it is cutting me off in the end so the client was more than happy because i was able to finish this project in less than an hour and you can also make your reframing experience super easy with the help of filmora 12. so this was it from my side so if you guys like this video and if you guys like the content about filmora and if you guys like to know more about filmora 12 make sure you are subscribing to wondershare filmora channel for more tutorials and tips like this so thank you for watching have a good one Goodbye.